So I wanted to make a quick video about some really cool ways to share data with people outside of your organization. Uh, we'll be using data from Four Rivers Vector Control with their permission. Um, what we'll do is use ArcGIS Desktop to share a map package to ArcGIS.com, ArcGIS Online, and then that that can be downloaded and used by other users of ArcGIS as well as by users of ArcGIS Explorer. So this is a way to share data without having to share a service. Uh, basically I'll go to sign in. I'm going to sign in as Four Rivers Vector Control. And then I simply select the data that I would like to share and right click create layer package. So there's no need necessarily to share any of the background data uh, the base map information because ArcGIS Explorer um, and ArcMap of course can use online base maps. So select the layers to include and upload this to the ArcGIS online account. Validate it first. If there are no messages then it is valid and then just hit share and it will start to copy that data up. I've already done that so I'm going to go ahead and cancel here but uh, it'll just load the data up and put it out there on ArcGIS.com. Uh, um, if I search for this in ArcGIS.com actually let me back up here when I, when I share this as a layer package I'm going to go ahead and do this uh, to my own account so I'll sign out and then sign into my account. Okay, so it's valid. Then we get to share it. When I share it, I can put a summary in here of what this is. A uh, description which will show up on ArcGIS.com. Credits, tags to make it searchable. And then I can choose whom to share it with. This is a key point. I can share it with everyone which means that it's searchable by anyone on ArcGIS.com. Or I can share it only with a member of my group and that group can be a public group that others can find and apply to be a member of or it could be a private group and be um, by invitation only. So I won't proceed with this but in the case of this data with uh, Four Rivers permission they did have it shared uh, so that it's searchable for everyone. So what we can do then is just go out to ArcGIS.com and if we type in Four Rivers then it finds the Four Rivers Vector Control Map Package. So if I click on that, I can look at details. It talks about how it was created, etc. And then if I open this, I can open it in ArcGIS Desktop if I have that, or I can download it. And it downloads this as a layer package. This LPK is like a it's it's like a KML document, and I can consume that in ArcGIS Explorer. ArcGIS Explorer is a free download from Esri's website so I've already downloaded and installed ArcGIS Explorer. So I'll start this up and we can add that data and explore it, uh, make presentations from it and add other online base maps to it as well. So it's a pretty, pretty nice way to share data with somebody that doesn't have ArcMap all the other online clients, ArcGIS.com, ArcGIS Viewer for Silverlight and Flex um, require that your data would be um, available in a service and so this is a nice way to share data without necessarily having a service. Okay, so I'm going to add content and I'm going to add ArcGIS layers and there's my Four Rivers Vector Control Map Package layers. So I'll add this in Okay, so then I can zoom to, let's 
let's see, my mosquito points. Let that redraw. I can zoom in. Okay. And I could switch the base map if I wanted to as well. Let's make it the Ving Maps hybrid. Takes a minute to redraw that. So as we can see, this is pretty darn nice. So ArcGIS Explorer does a whole bunch of other things, but basically we've just shared this data with whomever we choose to without having to have anything other than ArcGIS Explorer.